this is my second video on the 12 amp 4.5 volts to 30 volts DC step down buck converter it's a hundred watts converter I'll be testing it out today connecting it which I've already done this side here is the input this is the output that's the port to adjust the current it has a built-in fuse and a LED indicator it also has five capacitors two on the input side three on the output side two large heat sinks and a place for a fan. I've discussed this in the first video, but I didn't hook it up. As yet, and after I made the first video, I said I didn't know what that OVP is about. It's a over voltage protection these a blank which you could add certain things to it which i'm not that familiar with so today i will be turning on the power it would be 12 volts in but as any buck converter putting 12 volts in to it the output side would be about 11 11 something won't be 12 exactly but 11 something because it's a step down it's stepping down the current i think it would go as low as for either four or three but this is what the video is all about uh, the testing so let me put on my power supply and uh, let me show you all uh, what voltage i have coming into it something is the wrong oh didn't have it the right place and this is it wires wasn't properly connected this is what I have coming in to the buck converter now if I turn the port this is the adjustable port if I turn to increase as you can see at 4.3538 let's just say 38 the fan 4.38 the fan starts turning and the more I increase the voltage is the faster the fan will turn as you can see here the voltage is increasing you could use this on different projects if you're looking for a certain voltage to run your pro project you could set this in your power supply 
and adjust it to whatever voltage you want now it would take up to 30 volts so if you're looking for anything below 30 volts which my supply the highest voltage I can go up to is 19 I, I, I am planning of buying a, a 30 or 35 volt supply either to make mine my own or buy a ready-made bench top power supply while I'm speaking I keep on adjusting the voltage right now I'm at 10 to and if you can see the fan is going keep on adjusting I'm at 11 11 7 11 8 11 9 and that's where it, it stops at 11 9 I will be taking it down the indicator light right here I don't think you would be able to see it's lighting because I have a light hitting the component so you could use this on different projects 12 amps 100 watts you put it in 4.5 volts to 30 volts and you would get it 0 8 volts to 30 volts the specs I would leave all the specs for this in the description so you would have a look at them I bought it on Amazon as a matter of fact I have two of them from different vendors which one is neater than the other one this one has a lot of solder and splash it has a lot of flux on the on the border the other one is very very neat I haven't tested the other one yet but I will do that uh, shortly in another video but for so far it is pretty good let me see how low it would go before the meter goes out It's already going dim and that's it this is it for now if you find this video was helpful please like comment and subscribe you could also share this video Everything I use in this video, I'll put in the description <clears throat> below. It's a link to Amazon. If you purchase from me, I'll get a small commission at no extra cost to you. This is it for now. Until the next one. Bye.